Restock Air Jordan 4 Bread Reimagined Restock. Let's go. Let's talk about it. Make sure you guys smash that thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button right now. Let me know down below in the comments section what size you need in the Air Jordan 4 Bread Reimagined. Take a picture. Take a screenshot. DM me on Instagram. DannyMoore2369 with proof. Send me a DM with proof that you guys subscribed here to my YouTube channel. Good luck on a free pair of Jordan 4 Bread Reimagines. This giveaway ends on March 1st. Come back to the channel March 1st. The giveaway winner will be announced here on YouTube March 1st. And receive a DM from me over on Instagram as well on March 1st. So make sure you guys get your giveaway entries in for a free pair of Jordan 4 Bread Reimagine two sneaker bags for the price of one from crease guards click my link down below in the description Go cop yourself a fire sneaker bag these dividers. They come out. They move around You guys can put your clothes laptop chargers up to four pairs of sneakers inside of this one bag Two bags for the price of one click my link down below in the description Use my promo code Danny 40 for almost half off your entire order and that's right You're gonna receive two bags for the price of one and you also get a warranty with your order as well. Make sure you guys check out Crease Guards. Thank you, Crease Guards, for sponsoring today's fire video. Restocks for the Air Jordan 4 bread. Reimagined. We can expect some restocks for the Air Jordan 4 bread. Reimagined. The bread fours, they sold out. They flew. Everybody still wants to get their hands on a pair. Listen, if you have a pair, odds are good chance you might want another pair. So let's talk about restocks because the truth is Nike not only never sells out. I don't like saying that anymore because it's not really even true. Nike eventually sells out. I like saying that more because this is the truth when it comes to Nike. Nike sneakers, they like to hold back stock. Nike likes to hold stock. They like to give out a good amount of stock, don't get me wrong. They'll let go a lot of pairs, six figures of pairs, but they're still going to hold maybe 30, 40, 50,000 pairs. Who knows? But they're holding some pairs for a future Jordan Reserve restock. We know we will get one later on throughout the year. When we receive it, the Air Jordan 4 Bread Reimagined should be on it. It happened last year with the Air Jordan 3 Reimagined White Cement. If you guys remember, it wound up happening. It took, you know, a few months, but we wound up th did getting a restock. We will get a restock on this shoe. How do I know this? Why am I also saying this besides the Jordan 3 White Cement Reimagines? Because this is a massive GR. Listen, guys, they made a lot, a lot of stock. A lot of pairs. And when Nike makes a lot of pairs, when Nike makes a big, massive GR like this, they're going to do it. They're going to hold back some stock. And at a later date and time, we will receive more pairs. Now, is this really a restock, sort of say? Yes and no. Is Nike producing more pairs? No. No, no. Production's done. Production's been done for months on this shoe. Nike's production run is like six months in advance. It's like five, six months in advance. So if you guys look at the production dates, it'll tell you when this shoe was made, when they were manufactured. So this pair was started in June of last year and ended in August of last year. And they released in February. So yes, yeah, six months later. So they're not going to make new pairs. We're not getting more production. These restocks are basically just held back stock that Nike wants to hold back and later, at a later date and time, drop for a Jordan Reserve along with other sneakers on it. Last year, I believe we had some Jordan Reserves so like UNC Toes, Palominos, any big, big GR where they make a lot of pairs, I'm talking six figure stock plus, then we can account on a Jordan Reserve, some type of restock. You know, a few weeks ago, I believe we had the Jordan 11 restock. You see my point? When it's a big, massive GR, we can expect a future restock. I don't like saying Nike never sells out because that's not true. They do eventually sell out. So I like saying that better now. Nike eventually sells out. Eventually. Eventually. It could be years later. It could be months later. But yes, Nike still has stock of the Air Jordan 4 bread reimagined. So we can expect a Jordan Reserve, some type of restock on the sneakers app coming in the near future. Now, how about 
getting them for retail at a restock a little bit sooner. Well, my advice for that would be a few things. First and foremost, check your stores because late shipments are still a thing. For some reason, they're still going on. So late shipments are still a thing. So if you guys want, you can pop up in your stores throughout the next week, two weeks, three weeks, and just ask, hey, do you guys have any fours? Did any pairs come in? Hey, any returns for those resellers that don't know what they're doing and, you know, didn't even bother and just said, hey, I'm going to return it. You know, maybe they'll, you can get a return, something like that. So, yeah, check in stores. When it comes to in-store as well, you do want to make sure that you have connections. This is where connections with people that work at retailers really come into effect. They really come into play and help you big time. So, if you have a connect at a retailer, you could send the text, the phone call, hey, bro, you know, when you guys get fours in, please let me know. I'll come pick up pairs. And you might have to pay a little bit over retail, give your plug some money, but hey, you're getting them for well under resell, and you're still getting the Jordan 4 bread reimagined. It's the best way to go about it in this day and age. It's a lot about who you know and money. That's what it comes down to in the sneaker game it really comes down to who you know and money those are the two major factors now when it comes to online i recommend twitter twitter has been pushing out notifications of restocks restocks have been happening on Foot Locker. there was a restock actually the other day i tried for obviously i didn't get through but yes there was a restock randomly as well as what was the other site i think it was like wss or something like that CSS, some website like that. It's a retailer. They're all good to go. Sneaker Twitter, all these Twitter accounts, they tweet when these restocks are happening and it's all from retailers. Everything's 100% legit so that you know you're good to go. So Twitter is definitely a great place to check for restocks because these retailers are getting restocks and they're just randomly putting them out and then boom, these Twitter notifications, they have monitors to monitor the website force out the notification on Twitter, and if you have notifications on, you'll be notified, and you can hope that you get through. Now, here's the truth about restocks, because there's one major thing about restocks that absolutely sucks, and here's the truth. On release day, we had a lot of pairs, right? We had six figures. On restocks, you're not going to expect to see six-figure stock numbers at all. You're lucky if we see five, four to be honest, is more likely, even on websites like Sneaker Twitter, you're going to see like 20, 30 pairs, maybe 100 pairs if you're lucky, if you can get through the website. The truth about these restocks, guys, is that they are even harder to cop than the original release on release day. Release day happens to be the greatest chance that people have of copping because stock's the highest, demand's the highest, of course, at that time as well, but so is stock. So listen, guys, these are going to restock, but they're not going to be a walk in the park to cop on any restock. Restocks will not be easy to cop. We can expect a big major restock on the sneakers app here in 2024, but right now, they're not going to be a walk in the park to cop on any restock, guys. They're going to be a struggle. You guys have to put in the footwork even more to cop on a restock than you did on release date. So let me know down below in the comments if you guys were able to pick up the Jordan 4 Bread Reimagine. Let me know if you guys are going for any restocks. You guys know that these are definitely a sought-after sneaker, and they're going to restock. Let me know down below in the comments what do you guys think about the Jordan 4 Bread Reimagine. Make sure you guys get your giveaway entries in and hit that subscribe button for me. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys join the more family. Hit that subscribe button. Smash that like button. We're always on the grind. We're never gonna stop. Always dropping that fire. Straight fire. The Air Jordan 4 Bread Reimagine. Fire. Straight fire. Thank you guys so much for watching.